Hey there, let me show you how to create custom keyboard shortcuts in Pro Tools. Uh, this is using the Mac OS. If you're using Windows, I, I couldn't tell you how to do it. Uh, if you, in Mac, you go under the Apple over here, go to System Preferences, and hit this keyboard here, and make sure Keyboard Shortcuts is selected. You're going to hit this plus button here, and you're going to find Pro Tools. So if you don't see it listed here in the, in the list, hit the other at the bottom. And then I'm going to sort alphabetically, go down to Digi Design. This is version 9, but I'm sure it's going to work with any of the versions. Uh, select Pro Tools here, and double click it. Uh, now you have to, for menu title, this is something where you have to type exactly as it's listed in, in here. So I want to do the consolidate region. You can see right now it's assigned to something that involves multiple fingers and modifiers. So what I'm going to do is type, type it exactly with spaces, capitalization, consolidate region. If, even if there's dot, 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 you have to do that. The key that you choose has to, it can't be utilized by another Pro Tools shortcut already. So just make sure you know that it's not in use. So I'm going to hit F13 because those keys, F13 and above, most of them aren't really in use. So I'm going to hit Add. I'm going to check it out. If I go back to Pro Tools and I go back under the Edit menu, if I look under Consolidate Region, look what it says, F13. So in my session here, if I hit F13, there it goes, I consolidated the region. So I have some kind of weird little glitch where it's not showing the waveform, but it's it's still functional. You can see see the meter still going. Anyway, I hope this is helpful, and uh, I'll catch you next time.